So, you must be thinking like there are no precautions uh, doctors, allopathic doctors or western doctors are say, uh, saying, they are saying eat whatever. But as you know, we have uh, Ayurveda with us and in Ayurveda, a lot of precautions already have been mentioned what to do in Jwara that is fever. So, we should make use of it because as you know, there is no sure shot uh, treatment for any kind of uh, this corona virus. People, uh, uh, we are taking, uh, we are taking uh, the help of everything that is available in this world so that we will become healthy and uh, in our mind and in our body and get rid of corona as soon as possible. In Ayurveda, food is called as medicine. How we eat, what we eat, that is also going to impact our system uh, in a greater way. So, now two things I said not to eat. Now, the question comes, what should we eat? So, among fruits, many people are uh, eating watermelons. Whenever they have a lot of fever, they start eating watermelon. So, this watermelon and musk melon, these two melons, uh, they are also kapha enhancing fruit. So, if you having fever, if you don't have fever, if you don't have corona or any kind of viral fever or flu, in these conditions, if you are having uh, this watermelon, musk melon, this is good. It is very healthy, it's very hydrating, everybody should eat, especially it's seasonal fruit and it's summer season right now. So, everybody should eat. But if you are having fever, then you should avoid these two fruits and the fruits that you should eat is apple according to Ayurveda because apple uh, is very beneficial to enhance your digestive fire and it is very beneficial to make your rasa dhatu which is also equally responsible to enhance your immunity and uh, given you and, and it will provide you strength so that you will not suffer with a lot of weakness. In addition to apple, papaya, if you have willingness to have very hydrating fruit, you can have uh, berries. Berries are very beneficial. Uh, it will provide you a lot of immunity to your system, especially if you are having fever. In addition to that, chiku. Chiku is very beneficial fruit, uh, which will uh, not uh, enhance the water element in your body. And ultimately, it will not impact your lungs. So, chiku, papaya, uh, pomegranate. Pomegranate is also extremely beneficial uh, for, uh, for, for your health, especially if you are going through fever. So, what you need to do, you take all these fruits and wash it properly. After that, uh, put it in warm water for some time, like 10 minutes. After that, remove the peels and then eat. In this way, it will not impact your throat. And if your throat will be healthy, it is more chances like your virus or any kind of viral will not enter uh, to your lungs. Uh, because if your immunity uh, organ to organ, it is good, it, it will not uh, impact your organ that badly. So, that is the science behind it according to Ayurveda. So, what are the fruits that you should not take and totally no, no, especially if you are having viral fever that is banana. Uh, banana is extremely cooling in potency and it is extremely mucus enhancing fruit. So, banana you should avoid if you are having any kind of viral fever because if you see, because you will see if you eat banana, it will cause throat pain after some time if you keep eating banana and it is a mucus producing fruit. So, avoid banana in such situations. Many people were asking, uh, doctors are recommending vitamin C, so can we have uh, kiwi? Yes, you can have kiwi, you can have oranges, but it would be extremely beneficial if you eat these kiwi and oranges when sun is there. Because according to Ayurveda, the best time to consume citrus fruits is always the time when there is sun in the sky, so that it will take away the excessive cold from the fruit that is the thing behind why you should eat when sun is there because your digestive fire that time is very high and it becomes very easy for your digestive fire to digest orange and uh, kiwi all these citrus fruits where whatever citrus fruit if you want to eat you eat whenever there is sun in the sky so that it will be uh, so that it will get well digested in your system and provide you strength and immunity.